Largest crowd of the season at the Cedar Park Center just north of Austin. More than 6,200 in attendance. Both teams owned by NBA teams, the Toros by the Spurs, the 66ers by the Thunder. Late first quarter, 66ers up seven, and Tweedy Carter with the rock. He played his college ball at Baylor just 90 miles up the road. Tweedy hits the three. Then the steal, trying to beat the buzzer, but no good. Pretty sweet play, but not exactly Reggie Miller against the Knicks. Second quarter here, Toro's big man Marcus Kuzan drives and finds Thomas Gardner for the bank shot. 36-26 Tulsa. Then Austin turns up the defense. Kevin Palmer blocks Robert Vaden's shot and the Toros are off and running. Some nice passing and the big guy Kuzan rewarded for running the floor. The Toros continue to block shots. Lewis clinch with the rejection, but the 66ers recover and it's Vaden open for three. He had five triples in the game and finished with 21. Tulsa up 15 now when Elijah Millsap with a nice wraparound to OKC rookie Cole Aldridge. Pretty reverse. Aldridge would log 30 minutes after two quick fouls to put him on the bench. Still a double-digit deficit for Austin when Thomas Gardner sizes it up from deep. The three goes and the Toros within nine. Gardner would end up with 12. 80 to 71 visitors after three in the fourth. The three-point shooting continues for Austin. This time Michael Joyner from the wing. Aldrich again, posting up against Eric Dawson. The hook shot goes. The deficit, though, would be too much to overcome for the Toros. Millsap takes Squeaky Johnson to the rack. The shot no good, but Aldrich there for the offensive rebound and the putback. The final score, Tulsa 107, Austin 93. The loss puts the Toros back at 500 with a record of 7-7. Seven and seven. Remember, you can stream all games for free at the D-League website.